We're here at Speaker Point, Software Engineering and Solutions, at their open house and eighth anniversary. Welcome to FuseLogic TV. I'm your host, Walter Schwabe. I'm joined by Dr. Mike Annett, who's an HR professional here in Alberta, and we're at Speaker Point's open house. Mike, welcome to the show. Thank you. So let's talk a little bit about HR in general. And, uh, you know, here in Alberta, we've just passed 4 million people in population. We're growing like crazy. How do you see analytics impacting the staffing challenges that we're having here in Alberta? Staffing is about bringing uh, employees or regular citizens into a company, crossing that boundary into what an organization is. And uh, with the growth of Albertans, with the way that the population is growing, you really need to know where to target your efforts to attract the people that you want inside your company. So having a better understanding of analytics helps you in two really clear ways. The first way is it helps you frame the problem properly. Having an understanding of where people are, the types of profiles that they have, the type of people you want in your company, helps you do better than shooting in the dark with your advertisement efforts. The second way it helps you is helps you really understand how effective your strategies are working and whether or not you need to reframe them or refocus them. So you know, it's, a, it's almost like a different type of sales job in a sense because you're really trying to attract the right people for the culture, the right skill sets, those kinds of things. And so analytics is obviously helping companies and organizations with that in mind. Let's talk a little bit about directly the employee and employer relationship and how might analytics be impacting that relationship. Well, analytics can often be seen as uh, management information for their benefit only. Employees have a lot of power in the employee relationship as well because they have a lot of contextual information. They know what's happening at the ground level. So analytics is a bit of a balancing for management to know what's happening generally across the company. And with trends now for open data and employee empowerment, the more management is sharing that information with employees, um, the better the balance of power, the better the flow of information, and both sides of that equation can really work more effectively to the goals of the organization. You see that impacting as, as people retire, they're taking a lot of knowledge with them out of the organization, right? And so you've got that legacy of information and knowledge, that frontline knowledge you were just speaking about. You see analytics playing a role in that? Well, analytics in the, uh, in the early stages really identified who was leaving. So you had a good idea of what the, the challenges might be in the knowledge transfer and knowledge exchange. The way that analytics is helping now is it really helping identify what are the critical knowledges to have and whether those are actually with the folks that are leaving or if they're with the folks that are staying. Right, okay. Dr. Anna, thank you so much for joining us here at uh, Speaker Point on FuseLogic TV. We've been speaking with Dr. Mike Annett, and he's an HR professional in Alberta. Here at Speaker Point at their open house, I'm your host, Walter Schwab.